Well, a splash of blue, gray and yellow is bringing new life to an underutilized park here in Salisbury. It's a project with a mission to create a sense of community and grow the presence of art here in the city. 47 ABC's Javari Burnett has the details. Meet Shelton Hawkins, an Easton native who has a passion for basketball and art. He merged the two to create the Play in Color project, transforming basketball courts across the shore and now in Salisbury at Waterside Park. So I'm a direct descendant of Harry Tubman. So for me, it's kind of like my own version of the Underground Railroad where you can go to all these places, uh, safe spaces, and, and kind of, you know, go play basketball and enjoy your community. Both Hawkins and Salisbury Mayor Jake Day say they were waiting for the right time and place to start the project. And Waterside was the perfect location as it needed a little TLC. <laughs> We want to encourage neighborhood parks like Waterside to be well loved, well used, and uh, to be really beneficial to the, the kids and families that live in the neighborhood. It's an investment Mayor Day says will be an entryway to the presence of more art and culture in the city. With our ARP money, we invested in a number of things around the city, and this is one of them. Uh, so this is one of the benefits of uh, the federal funding that we got, um, and so we're really excited to see it come to fruition. One of the unique things about Play in Color is that they call on the community to help bring these masterpieces to life. And I was able to show off my own Picasso skills. But Hawkins tells me the mission is bigger than basketball. In 2006, my cousin passed away on, on the basketball court in Easton. And we noticed that nobody was using that basketball court for like 10 years. Nobody would go out there and play. So we just kind of wanted to get people back outside playing basketball again. Even if you don't want to play basketball, the main goal is one of the goals is like make sure that the court is cool enough. You want to come hang, you can take photos and all that type of stuff. So just enjoy the space. In Salisbury, Javari Burnett, 47 ABC, WMDT. I just love that. I want to be out there painting with them. Mayor Day tells us that the Waterside Park project will be one of many art initiatives coming to the city soon. The artwork is expected to be completed by this weekend with a ribbon cutting ceremony to follow in the coming weeks.